So today, about quarter to one, I walked in on Louise, who is hanging right there on that lower branch. And this potted plant, laying what will turn out to be her fifth egg this season, but her fourth good egg. So what I'm going to do now is uh, stop this, pull that plant out, and show you guys as I carefully um, sift through the soil to try to find the egg. Be right back. So what I do is in this planet pot is I put some sphagnum moss in small chunks along the top and generally that way I can determine if uh, the lizards have been rooting around in it so I know when to go look. I was just lucky enough this time to actually see her in here. Um, her first three eggs, uh, I actually, she knocked some of this out onto the terrarium enclosure bottom so I knew she had been in the, in the pot. Uh, the fourth egg that I just recovered, I believe, two days ago, um, I just thought it was time. And so I went looking in here, but I didn't notice anything messed up. Now, in here we go. So, there's egg number five for Louise. So I'm going to get this pot back into the enclosure and I'm going to go let this join its three uh, siblings that I'm currently incubating. Be right back. And so there are the four eggs. This was the first one and, excuse me, second one, third, fourth, and fifth. Um, I have them incubating at about uh, 84 degrees and usually it's about 90 degree, 90% uh, humidity in this hobobator uh, powered by a uh, Vivarium Electronics VE100 thermostat.